Hello folks, this is uh, 2021, October, November, paper 1-1, one, one, and the question number is uh, 16. Uh, this question is about, uh, it is about uh, full mechanics here, more about uh, uh, work energy and power. It says, a pulley of radius 0 0.40 meters, so R is equal to 0 0.40 meters, supports weights of uh, 20 newton and uh, uh, 15 newton here, so this is, let us say, W1 and uh, W2 here by means of a thin string as shown thin string as shown the weights are moved slowly by rotating the pulley clockwise through an angle of 60 degrees so we rotate it clockwise by a certain angle which is 60 degrees so theta is equal to 60 degrees so I can say if the point if a certain mark is like this this mark goes like this and this angle becomes 60 degrees 60 degrees what is the increase in the total gravitational potential energy of the weights? So we have to find uh, the increase in gravitational potential energy. So what happens here is, if I do like this, it will come down, it will come up. So it's a GPE will increase. So it's a GPE will increase. And it's a GPE will decrease. And the height it moves up will be equal to the height it moves down. So if we have to find how much height does it move up or down. And that height is equal to the displacement along this uh, circular arc during that uh, 60 degree rotation. These uh, heights, the change in these heights are equal to the angular displacement that happens here. So first let us find that angular displacement. That angular displacement is equal to S is equal to equal to uh, uh, theta into R theta should be in radians so this uh, 60 degree should be uh, 60 into pi by 180 radians into this r is 0 0.40 so now how that becomes is we know that uh, pi radians is equal to 180 degrees so that is 180 degrees is equal to pi radians so 1 degree equal to pi by 180 radians and 60 degree is equal to pi by 180 into 60 radians so we have this and this will give me this will give me when i do the calculation it will be uh, 60 into shift pi divided 180 equal to and into 0 0.4 is equal to so it becomes 0 0.42 0 0.42 meters so it moves up by 0 0.42 meters and it goes down by 0 0.42 meters so now uh, its pe will increase its pe will increase its pe will decrease so what we have is so delta pe of this left one is equal to w1 into this s equal to 20 into 0 0.42 Similarly, delta P of this thing is equal to, delta P of the right one is equal to W2 into, yes, that's equal to 15 into 0 0.42. So now the total change should be equal to, so we have got, uh, this is 20 and 15, this is 42. So this thing is greater, this is greater, this is smaller. So therefore, overall, total change, total change should be equal to, equal to, uh, 20 into 0 0.40 minus 15 into 0 0.42 it's because it will increase its decrease so they are of opposite signs like this so it should be equal to so when I do it in calculations it will be equal to 20 minus 15 is 5 so it is 5 into 0.42 becomes 2.1 so it is 2.1 joules and 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 if you look at the answers uh, choice number C is the Correct choice. All of this wrong.